All right, so today we're taking a look at the brand new Fujifilm Instax Square Link, but first, let me go get a coffee. I'm good now. So we've been waiting for square format link printer to come and it's now here. So exciting. Okay, so first let's take a look at what comes in a box. So we have the user manual, a USB-C cable to charge the printer. Nice. And finally we have the printer itself. All right, so let's take it out the protective paper and peel off the protective stickers. So the square link comes in two different colors. We have the ash white and the midnight green options. Now let's take a look around the printer. So the square link uses square format film and we can insert it by pushing this little button here. The film door will open and we can align the yellow tab on the film cartridge with the yellow tab on the printer. And then we can close the door. And then now the printer will eject the protective black card. Looking at the side of the printer, we have our USB-C port to charge the printer. And on the front, we have a function button and our power button with an LED status indicator. The Square Link uses Bluetooth technology to connect to your smartphone, which makes it very easy to connect. Simply power on the printer, open up the free Square Link app and you will be prompt to connect your device. Once your printer is detected, simply press connect to start using it. First thing we are going to do is set the printer to either rich or natural mode. This setting can be found in the settings of the app, allowing you to choose the rich mode, which gives you more vibrant colors, more contrast and saturation, or the natural mode, which will be more true to life, less saturated and less contrasty. So you can choose between the two modes in the settings of the app. The first feature will be the simple print, which is where you go into your camera roll and then you select an image or even a video. Now obviously you can't print a video, but rather select a frame within a video and print it. And then from there, you can go and apply filters, stickers, templates, reframe it, rotate it, do various things and then print your image. Now if you want to reprint an image, you can simply hold the function button on the printer for two seconds and you will get a second copy of the last image you printed. Now if you want to reprint a previous image, you can go back into the print history on the home screen and find the image and you can print it again. Our next feature is the AR print, which definitely brings your Instax image to the next level. You can now merge augmented reality with Instax prints. You can add special effects, text, a picture, a background color, or even doodle to your Instax image. Also, if you play with text and doodles, you can add animations to it. You simply select the effect you want to add and adjust it to your liking and position the QR code where you want it on your image. You can then preview the effect before printing it, and when you're satisfied, go ahead and print. Now using the camera on your smartphone, scan the QR code and watch your effects come to life. I just love how the AR effect follows even when you tilt the print. And this mode definitely expands the creative possibilities. Next we have Instax Connect. This allows you to send an Instax photo with a message to family and friends. And they don't necessarily need the app to see it. If they do and have a square link, they can easily print the image themselves. You can add a message to it and again, make various corrections to the image or images because you can add multiple images on the same print with various layouts. Then you can click on the little envelope and decide how you want to send it, whether it's by social media, text messages, and so on. The person receiving it will also be able to add in a comment and when they do, you will get a notification. So you can have a little chat on the print, a fun feature, especially if it is between friends or family living far away from you. They can also remove the comments to get a clean print and the image will remain available for a month before it disappears. You can also add reminders for various events like birthdays so that on a special day, you can send them a happy birthday print. We also have the editable print tab where we can select various templates to create a collage on a single Instax square print and frames are also available to add a bit of flair to your prints. 
Now we still have some of my favorite features like sketch, edit, and print, which I love to use because it allows me to add a watermark to my images whenever I'm on a shoot and I wanna share images with the models. And we have the Instax camera, which allows us to take images using our phone directly into the app itself. All right, so I hope you enjoyed this look at the brand new and exciting Instax Square Link. Now, as you know, I'm a big Instax fan. I have them all over my house, so I'm definitely excited about this new product here. So that'll be it for today, and now I'm going to print some more because you can never have too many Instax photos around. <laughs>